Hey everyone, welcome back to effect for you channel. Today we are going to create Black Friday Instagram story, like this. So let's get started. As usual, first create a new composition, and this should be vertical comp. I am using 1080 by 1920 pixels, and I called this main comp, but you can keep any name as you like. Now create a new solid layer, and search gradient ramp effect. Select any start and end color as you like, and adjust point as per your choice. Now select Pen tool and create a shape like this. Stroke should be none, and fill any color as you like. We need to add the gradient effect on our shape layer, so copy the gradient effect, and paste it here. Adjust the point a little bit closer to the shape layer. Now create one more shape below the first shape. And paste the same gradient effect on it. And adjust the point close to the shape. Here I want to change the swap color. I need to add one more effect on shape layer. So select shape layer and search drop shadow effect. Increase distance around 50, softness 120, and change the direction upper side of the shape. Perfect, you can also change the opacity around 40%. Now copy the effect and paste it on other shape layer. But here I want to change the direction bottom side of the shape. Now we need to animate the shapes. So select shape layer, open position, and add a keyframe around 20 frame forward, then go to first frame and move the top shape layer left side of the comp, and bottom shape right side of the comp. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this, if your graph not look like this, so right and select edit speed graph. Just move the bottom shapes keyframe few frame ahead. Perfect. Now we need to create other shape, so select rectangle tool, and create a rectangle like this. Move the anchor point center of the rectangle, then search gradient ramp effect, and choose the color as you like. and move the point closer to the rectangle. Now open rectangle, then open transform rectangle, and increase the skew around 20. And also rotate the shape around minus 10 degrees. Now we need to animate this shape also, select shape layer hit S for scale, and add a keyframe around 20 frame forward. Then go to first frame, unlink the scale, and change X scale amount 0%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Move the layer around 10 frame forward. Perfect. Now create one more shape like this. And move the layer below to the rectangle layer. And copy the same gradient ramp effect. And move the point closer to the shape. 
Here we need to add the drop shadow effect on the top shape layer. Increase the softness around 120. Now we need to animate the bottom shape layer. First move the anchor point center of the shape, hit P for position, and go to around 20 frame forward, and add a keyframe, then go to first frame and move the shape right side of the comp. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Also move the layer few frame forward. Go to the first keyframe on the shape layer, and move the shape little bit downside, because we don't want any gap between these both shape layer. Perfect. Now create the same shape left side of the comp. and apply the same gradient ramp effect and adjust the point close to the shape and do the same animation I am skipping this part so that you don't have to wait after animate the shape move the layer few frame forward Perfect. Now here we need to add the text, so select text tool and type your text. Now rotate the text little bit. Now we need to animate this, so open text tool. Go to animate, and select position, and opacity. Move the Y position little bit bottom side of the comp. And opacity 0%, now open range selector, then advance. And change shape, ramp up, and ease high around 50%. Now go to first frame add a keyframe on offset. And change amount minus 100%. Then go to few frame forward and change the offset 100%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. I think we should move the keyframe a little bit. And also move the layer few frame forward. Now duplicate the text layer, and change your text. Also move the layer few frame forward. Now we need to add some elements around the text, so select bend tool and create a triangle shape like this. Create multiple shape around the text. After creating all shapes, now we need to add color in our shapes, so select shape one by one and add fill color. Perfect. Now move the anchor point center of the all shapes. You can change the layer's color, so we can identify them easily. Now animate the shapes, so go to around 20 frame forward, and add a keyframe on position, then go to first frame, and move the shape in the center one by one.
Now select all keyframes and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now we need to add wiggle expression on our layer, so hold alt key and click on stopwatch icon, and type wiggle expression. Also apply the same expression in other layers, so right click on position, select copy expression only, then select all shape layers, and paste it here. Perfect. Now move the all shape layers few frame forward, when our text start going to visible. Perfect. I think we need to adjust this shape little bit like this. Perfect. Now we need to add another text here, so select text tool and type your text. Change the text color as you like. Also rotate the text little bit. Now we need to animate the text, so open text layer, go to animate, and select position and opacity. Move the position x left side of the comp and opacity 0%. Now select animator, and add expression selector. Open expression selector, here I have a delay script. So copy the script, hold alt key and click on stopwatch icon, and paste it here. Change based on character to words, Also move the layer few frame forward. Perfect. Now add one more text bottom of the sale text. So select text tool and type your text. Do the same animation as we done with our sale text. and move the layer few frame forward. Now bottom side of the comp, we need to add swipe up text. So first select the pen tool, and create a arrow shape like this. Fill color none, and stroke white. Now we need to animate this, so go to first frame, hit P for position, and add a keyframe, then go to few frame forward, and move little bit upside of the comp, then again go to few frame forward, and move little bit downside of the comp. Here we need to add expression on this, so hold alt key and click on stopwatch icon, and type loop out expression. So our icon continuously move up and down, Perfect. Now add swipe up text here, so select text tool and type your text. Now apply the same animation as we have done with our other text. But this time we need to change the position Y bottom side of the comp, and apply the same delay expression. Also change the based on character to words. Select the both layers and move few frame forward. Perfect. Now add some text on top of the comp, so select text tool and type your text. You can type your website name and anything, 
Again apply the same animation and delay expression on it. Also change the based on character to words. And move the layer few frame forward. Again create another new text. You can change the text color as you like. Then add the same animation as we done with other text. Move the position bottom side of the comp. And apply delay expression. And change based on character to words. Move the layer few frame forward. Perfect, our animation has done. Let's see the preview. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. So please like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. For more tutorial, I'll see you in the next video.